Hey, what's going on? I'm Brandon America, and thanks for tuning in to another Logic Lesson. Well, I've had a lot of people asking recently, what's the best way to send a Logic Pro X session to another person to collaborate on? Maybe you've got a drummer, guitar player, a vocalist, or somebody that can't come to your studio and work on the song with you. So in this case, I'm going to show you the best two ways to save your session and ultimately the best way to save it and send it off to that collaborator. So uh, let's say you just get done working on a project, you got a song, for instance, this is one of my songs called Highway, right? Okay, so I'm at a point now where I'm like, yo, I just need a little more guitar from my guitar friend. So what I'm going to do is come up here to File, Select, Save As, and if you'll look here where my mouse is, you say, uh, you'll say you have two options, Organize My Project As A Package Or A Folder. Well, typically on my computer, I save them as a folder. And what that does is if you look here, it'll actually break down all of your different elements together. So you got your bounces, your freeze files, your audio files. Here are all of your uh, sessions that you've actually saved. But in order to make sure that all of your audio and everything is going to be together, what we want to do to send this off is actually select package. Uh, you don't have to do anything else you know, funky from there. A uh, couple options down here, you know, you want your audio files included. If you have used the ESX instruments and samplers, you'd want to select that. If you use the Ultra Beat, you want to select that. The Alchemy, that's a uh, MIDI, I'm sorry, a synth plugin. And so if you have a movie, you'd want to include that or if you've included anything from the Apple Sound Library. So any of these that apply, make sure you check those. And when you save this as a package, you're just going to hit save. And we're already it's asking, let's, let's save this as 5.1, right? So we're gonna save it as 5.1. And now what it's done though, is it's copying everything. So if you were to maybe say drop and drag an audio file in from somewhere else, maybe a sound library or something, sometimes they don't get attached to your actual folder session. And by creating a project save session, now everything will be in this one thing. You don't have to worry about sending bounces or sending audio clips or any other things. It will all just be consolidated together. And then whatever best way you feel like you can send it off to that person using WeTransfer, uh, with Dropbox, Google Drive, whatever you have, iCloud, um, you would just upload that package folder, send it off to them. They'll be able to open it up. And when they go to send you something back in a Logic session, you just need to ask them to do the same thing. Make sure they save it as a package and then send it on back and you guys can keep rocking so just a quick tip today from your boy brand america hope you guys learned something and uh if you haven't subscribed already please go ahead and hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell drop a like and if you have any questions about this please put it in the comments below i'll get back with you asap so until next time you guys peace and love